Good evening, fellow sports investors. Today, I'd like to tell you about a new system for NBA basketball. It's called Aragorn and Legolas System by Trey. It can be found inside the private forum of the VIP club of Z-Code Sport Investors. Now, in order to find this system, you just need to go to the forum in a section of NBA basketball, and then you choose the topic of new Aragorn and Legolas system for NBA. Here, you can see the full description of this system, but to help you understand that system, I have recorded this video tutorial for you. Right, well, the system is very simple to understand and follow. It gives only one or two signals per week, so you do not need to place daily bets or a large number of bets. This system is very selective and easy to follow. Usually, it gives signals three or four hours before the first game. Now, that means you have enough time to place your bets, and you do not need to wake up in the middle of the night and wait when the game begins. Before I get into further explanation about the system, I want to show you its results. The system itself has two types of signals that are named in honor of two main characters of the Lord of the Rings. One signal is Aragorn, that has a starting bet size of $100, and its maximum risk is only $825. Progression is called soft in this system. It means low risk. Also, this system does not need any recovery sessions, which is perfect and safe. In other words, the system is very simple, and you do not have to calculate the unit size in this case, because it gives you the right bet size and the right spread which you have to buy. Later, I'll give you some examples. Now, let's check out the amazing results. The system was tested back to 2005, and it showed a solid profit of well over $16,000. I was given access to backtest the system. Now, I'm switching to Firefox to the backtest of the system from 2005. Here, I have all the bets that were placed by the system, and we see the system wins up to 80% of the bets. And this is very high winning rate, trust me, guys. Now, I'm scrolling down, and all bets were placed over the years, and I checked them personally. Here is a graph of net balance growth. We see that the worst thing that could happen is a loss of $825. Here, it happened once in 2010, but as you can see, the system is very stable and quickly recovered its profit. Here is the distribution of profit for the days of the week, and we see that all days are profitable. Here is a distribution of the bet values, and the majority of bets were placed on the minimum size of $100, $120, $130, and $150, and only a few bets on the maximum size of $825. The total profit amounted to $10,280. Here is the profit by various spreads and its percentage of winning bets was 78% by the spread, which is a very high number, guys. Now, I'm switching back to talk about the second signal. This signal is called Legolas. It's performance a little worse, but it gives a higher number of bets. It is very profitable, too. As you can see in the graph, it made $5,500 profit in the same period, and that's slightly lesser than the main signal, but it will give you more bets. These two signals are independent. Sometimes they give the exact same game with different bet size, but mostly they give different games. Now, let's look at a specific example. Now, I'm moving on to the members area and selecting the old date on which was a signal. Usually, these signals are shown on the left in the form of the qualified box with an avatar. Here can be seen that the Aragorn signal was registered in this game, and it tells us that we should bet on 1.2 units on Miami, minus 4 spread at 1.4 odd. In this system, it's important to buy several points of the spread. For example, if the standard spread is minus 8.5, then we buy 50% of the spread each time. This achieves a high percentage of winning bets, as we bet not on the standard spread, but on half of the standard spread. That means minus four in this case. As you can see here, is nothing to calculate. The system automatically tells you what unit size to bet, what spread you need, and what will be the odds. For example, if you have a unit size and that's $100, then the bet will be $120. If your unit size is $10, then the bet will be $12. Let's take a look at how to find the bet in a bookmaker. 
as the Miami Heat does not play today, I take any other team. Basically, we need to find the bet with a half of spread from the standard on the specified team. I just switch to Bet365 Bookmaker and I click on Basketball on the left menu. Then I click on Game Lines and hear all the teams that play today. Imagine we place the bet on Memphis Grizzlies. 50% of that spread, namely the standard spread, is minus 10.5. And Aragorn told us today that the bet on the Memphis Grizzlies spread of minus 5.5. I click right here to see more bets on this game. Next, I click on additional point spread. I need to find Mem Grizzlies minus 5.5. Here is this bet below on left. Mem Grizzlies minus 5.5. Odds around 1.5. For one. Well, odd is a little low, but it's more than enough to get the profit in the system, and do not be surprised that the odd is a bit low. Usually it ranges from 1.3 to 1.45 for the system, and that's enough. It is important to keep the bet size that is given by the system. If the system says to bet 1.2 units, we have to use precisely such that size, not a fixed or any other size. Here, I'm clicking on minus 5.5, and on the right, we can place our bet. The price is $120, then we place the bet. Now, I show you how to do the same thing in Five Dimes Bookie. In fact, I need to buy a half of the standard spread, namely to buy some points. Not all bookmakers allow buying the points, but most of them, such as Five Dimes, Paddy Powers, and Bet365, permit to do it. Here, on the left, I click on straight and RAF, then I click on the NBA, and I'm looking for the game which was advised by Aragorn, and since it's not here today, I again choose Mem Grizzlies as example. Suppose Aragorn advised me to buy Mem Grizzlies for minus 5.5, but I was offered to buy for minus 10.5, which is not good. I click on minus 10.5, and in a Dropbox window, I can select the spread I need, namely minus 5.5. I place my bet for $120, but 5 dimes ratios are too low compared with others, so we can increase the bet by 20% to compensate the juice. If you use 5 dimes, all your bets could be increased by 20%. Then you compensate this low ratio by slightly increasing the bet, namely my bet will be $140. Mem Grizzlies. 5.5. Next, I click on Continue, and the bet will be placed. These signals are posted online in this topic by Trey or signal bots. For example, December 18, bet Miami minus 4 spread at 1.42 odd, 1.2 unit, and Lego Las, no signals today. Also, there is a second way to find them. They are on the VIP Picks page. Usually, the signals appear three or four hours before the game, and if such a game was classified, the signal appears on the left side of the page. For example, here the signal tells bet 1.5 units on Miami, minus 7.5 spread at 1.3 odd. Here, it is very important to keep the advised betting size. If you do that, your profit graph will look like this, just like in our system test. The system itself is fully automated and very profitable. Well, I hope I've not confused you and explained everything in detail. Follow the system and win! In conclusion, here is the overall chart of the two signals, Aragorn and Legolas, since 2005. They made a total of $16,000 profit, approximately 25 to 30 units per season, and 500 bets for that time. Amazing results, right? Follow the system, keep advised betting size of the signals, and your graph will grow over the time. Good luck!